Listening test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand spoken English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC listening test with half the usual number of questions. You don't need to write anything down. Answers are provided immediately after each question. There are four parts and directions will be given for each. Let's begin. Let's kick off with part one, listening photographs. Get ready to analyze some images and pick the best response. Number one. A. A teacher is handing out books to students. B. A group of students is walking down the hallway. C. A woman is giving a presentation in an auditorium. D. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. The correct answer is D. A man is writing mathematical equations on a blackboard. Number 2. A. A man is walking through a busy street. B. Two people are working in a garden. C. A group of people is having lunch outdoors. D. People are standing in line at an airport. The correct answer is D. People are standing in line at an airport. Number 3. A. People are attending a meeting. B. A woman is using her phone in a shopping mall. C. A man is ordering food at a cafe. D. A group of students is playing basketball. The correct answer is B. A woman is using her phone in a shopping mall. Number 4. A. Engineers are presenting a project in an office. B. A man is sitting on a chair working on his laptop at a construction site. C. A construction team is building a large skyscraper. D. Workers are having a meeting at a construction site. The correct answer is B. A man is sitting on a chair working on his laptop at a construction site. Number 5. A. A group of people is exercising in a park. B. A woman is sitting on a bench using her phone in a park. C. A man is preparing a presentation for a meeting. D. A family is having a picnic at a park. The correct answer is B. A woman is sitting on a bench using her phone in a park. Number 6. A. A man is preparing a meal in a kitchen. B. A group of people is jogging in a park. C. A woman is talking on her phone in a cafe. D. Two people are playing tennis. The correct answer is C. A woman is talking on her phone in a cafe. Now, let's move on to part two. Listening, question response. Time to sharpen your listening skills and pick the correct replies. Number one. Who is going to lead the meeting? A. John will be in charge. B. I have a meeting at 2 p.m. C. Yes, I am attending. The correct answer is A. John will be in charge. Number two. Who is responsible for the payroll this month? A. I usually walk to work. B. No, I haven't seen it. C. It's Andrew's responsibility. The correct answer is C. It's Andrew's responsibility. Number 3. How do you get to the train station? A. Take the bus number 5. B. Yes, I often use it. C. It's very nearby. The correct answer is A. Take the bus number 5. Number 4. How long have you been working here? A. For about 3 years. B. I'll start next week. C. No, I don't. The correct answer is A. For about 3 years. Number 5. Do you know when the next train arrives? A. I'm not sure about the schedule. B. Yes, let's check the timetable. C. 
It should arrive in 15 minutes. The correct answer is C. It should arrive in 15 minutes. Number 6. Could you help me with this data entry task? A. No, the data is from last year. B. Sure, I can start right away. C. It is a new project. The correct answer is B. Sure, I can start right away. Number 7. What is the purpose of this presentation? A. To inform about the new policy. B. The room is already booked. C. The projector isn't working. The correct answer is A. To inform about the new policy. Number 8. When will the repairs be finished? A. I need to call the repairman. B. Yes, they started yesterday. C. By next Friday. The correct answer is C. By next Friday. Number 9. Why did you choose this color? A. Because it matches the theme. B. It wasn't on sale. C. I chose it yesterday. The correct answer is A. Because it matches the theme. Number 10. Is the office open on weekends? A. Only on Saturdays. B. Yes, from 9 to 5. C. No, it's closed. The correct answer is B. Yes, from 9 to 5. Number 11. Why did you move to this city? A. I plan to stay here. B. I have not decided yet. C. For a new job opportunity. The correct answer is C. For a new job opportunity. Number 12. Why are the lights off? A. The power is out. B. We have new lights installed. C. I'll contact the electrician. The correct answer is A. The power is out. Great job so far. Next is part three. Listening, conversations. Listen carefully to short dialogues and answer the questions that follow. Number one. We need to arrange a team building activity. Any ideas? How about a cooking class? That sounds fun. I'll look into possible venues. Let's plan it for next Friday. Noted. I'll start making arrangements. When is the team building activity planned? A. This Friday. B. Next Friday. C. Next Monday. The correct answer is B. Next Friday. Number 2. Did you receive the revised contract from the client? Yes, I got it this morning and I'm reviewing it now. Any changes? Just a few minor ones. I'll send my comments later today. What is the woman doing with the contract? A. Reviewing it. B. Ignoring it. C. Signing it. The correct answer is A. Reviewing it. Number 3. Have you received the new marketing strategy document? Yes, I have. I'll go over it tonight. Let's discuss it tomorrow afternoon then. Sounds good. I'll be ready. When will they discuss the marketing strategy document? A. This afternoon. B. Tomorrow morning. C. Tomorrow afternoon. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow afternoon. Number 4. Can you assist with the presentation next Monday? Sure. What time do you need my help? Let's start at 9 a.m. I'll be there. When will they start working on the presentation? A. 10 a.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 11 a.m. The correct answer is B. 9 a.m. Number 5. The printer in the main office is out of order. 
Oh no, that's not good. I called the service team and they said they'll come by this afternoon. Thanks for handling that. When will the service team come? A. This morning. B. This afternoon. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is B. This afternoon. Number 6. Can we reschedule our meeting to Friday? I'm out of the office on Friday. How about Thursday instead? That should work. Let's confirm it. All right. I'll send a calendar invite. What day is the man proposing for the meeting? A. Friday. B. Wednesday. C. Thursday. The correct answer is A. Friday. Number 7. Hello. I would like to schedule a dental appointment. Of course. Are you available next Monday afternoon? Yes, that works for me. Perfect. We'll see you at 2 p.m. When is the dental appointment? A. Next Monday afternoon. B. Next Monday morning. C. Tomorrow afternoon. The correct answer is A. Next Monday afternoon. Number 8. Can you send me the final draft of the report by end of day? Sure. I'll have it ready and emailed to you by 5 p.m. Great, thanks. Do you need anything else? No, that's all for now. When will the final draft of the report be sent? A. By 5 p.m. B. In the morning. C. By noon. The correct answer is A. By 5 p.m. Number 9. Our client has requested an update on the project status. I'll prepare a report and send it over by end of day. Please include the latest milestones achieved. Certainly. I'll make sure everything is up to date. What will the woman include in the report? A. Latest milestones. B. Project delays. C. Budget details. The correct answer is A. Latest milestones. Number 10. I just got an email about a business trip to Chicago next week. Really? I haven't received anything yet. Check your spam folder. It might be there. Good idea. I'll do that now. Where is the business trip? A. To Boston. B. To Chicago. C. To New York. The correct answer is B. To Chicago. Number 11. Could you send me the updated report by tomorrow? Sure. I'll have it ready by noon. Great. I need it for the meeting at 3 p.m. Understood. You'll have it in your inbox by then. When is the man's meeting? A. At noon. B. At 4 p.m. C. At 3 p.m. The correct answer is C. At 3 p.m. Number 12. Our team dinner is planned for next Thursday. Can you make it? Thursday is tricky for me. Can we do Friday instead? Let me confirm with the rest of the team and I'll let you know. What might change about the dinner? A. The date. B. The location. C. The attendees. The correct answer is A. The date. Let's dive into part four. Listening talks. You'll hear brief talks or speeches, so stay focused for the questions. Number one. Are you looking for a healthier lifestyle? Join our yoga classes every Tuesday and Thursday at 6 p.m. Our experienced instructors will guide you through relaxing and strengthening exercises suitable for all levels. Sign up at the front desk. When are the yoga classes held? A. Tuesday and Thursday at 6 p.m. B. Friday at 5 p.m. C. Monday and Wednesday at 6 p.m. The correct answer is A. Tuesday and Thursday at 6 p.m. Number 2. Our annual charity run is happening next Sunday. 
Registration starts at 7 a.m. and the race kicks off at 8 a.m. Water stations are located every mile along the 5K route. All proceeds go to local children's hospitals. Come and support a great cause. What time does the race start? A. 9 a.m. B. 7 a.m. C. 8 a.m. The correct answer is A. 8 a.m. Number 3. Parents and students are invited to our school's open house next Tuesday evening. Explore the campus, meet the faculty, and learn about our programs. The event starts at 6 p.m. in the auditorium with a welcome speech by the principal. We hope to see you there. When does the open house event start? A. 7 p.m. B. 6 p.m. C. 5 p.m. The correct answer is C. 6 p.m. Number 4. Join us for the annual charity run this Sunday. The event starts at 8 a.m. sharp, and participants are advised to arrive at least 30 minutes early for registration. All proceeds will go to local health care facilities. Wear comfortable attire and stay hydrated. What time does the charity run start? A. 8 a.m. B. 9 a.m. C. 8.30 a.m. The correct answer is C. 8 a.m. Number 5. This summer, take advantage of our special travel packages to beautiful beach destinations. Book now and enjoy discounts on flights, hotels, and local tours. Visit our website for more details and to make a reservation. What is the special offer about? A. Complimentary breakfast. B. Discounts on travel packages. C. Free local tours. The correct answer is C. Discounts on travel packages. Number 6. Our new software update includes several improvements to enhance user experience. Key features include faster load times, improved security protocols, and a more intuitive interface. Users can download the update starting tomorrow by visiting our website. We recommend backing up your data before proceeding with the installation. When can users start downloading the update? A. Next week. B. Today. C. Tomorrow. The correct answer is C. Tomorrow. Number 7. We are excited to announce the grand opening of our new bookstore next week. The event will feature a ribbon-cutting ceremony, special discounts, and a book signing by a famous author. Don't miss out on the celebration starting at 10 a.m. sharp. What will happen at the grand opening? A. A cooking class. B. A ribbon-cutting ceremony. C. A movie screening. The correct answer is C. A ribbon cutting ceremony. Number 8. Please note that this building is a smoke free zone. Smoking is only allowed in designated areas located outside. We appreciate your cooperation in maintaining a healthy environment for everyone. Where is smoking allowed? A. In designated areas outside. B. In the lobby. C. Anywhere in the building. The correct answer is B. In designated areas outside. Number 9. Our library offers a variety of programs for all ages, including story hours for children, book clubs for adults, and computer classes. Check the schedule on our website for dates and times. Membership is free and open to everyone. What does the library offer for adults? A. Story hours. B. Art classes. C. Book clubs. The correct answer is C. Book clubs. Number 10. Join us for an informative workshop on financial planning this Thursday evening. Our expert speaker will cover topics such as budgeting, investments, and retirement planning. The workshop will be held in the community center from 6 p.m. to 8 p.m. Attendees will have the opportunity to ask questions and receive personalized advice.
What topics will the workshop cover? A. Cooking. B. Gardening. C. Financial planning. The correct answer is B. Financial planning. Number 11. Thank you for choosing super clean services for your cleaning needs. We offer professional cleaning for homes and offices using environmentally friendly products. Our services include deep cleaning, carpet cleaning, and window washing. To book an appointment or for more information, please visit our website or call our customer service hotline. What type of cleaning products does Super Clean Services use? A. Environmentally friendly products. B. Chemical based products. C. Generic products. The correct answer is C. Environmentally friendly products. Number 12. Welcome to our community festival. Today, you can enjoy various activities including live music, food stalls, and children's games. The main event, the talent show, will start at 5 p.m. on the main stage. Have a great time! Huh? What is the main event and its starting time? A. Children's games at 3 p.m. B. The live music at 5 p.m. C. The talent show at 5 p.m. The correct answer is C. The talent show at 5 p.m. Reading test. In this section, you'll demonstrate your ability to understand written English. This is a shortened version of the TOEIC reading test with half the usual number of questions. No need to rush, just follow along, and answers will be provided after each question. There are three parts, and directions will be given for each. Let's begin! Time for the reading section. Let's start with part five. Incomplete sentences. Fill in the blanks with the correct words. Number one, he apologized. The delay in sending the documents. A, on, B, two, C, four, D, with. The correct answer is C, four. Number two. John can play the piano. His younger brother. A. Better than. B. Well as. C. As good as. D. Good as. The correct answer is. A. Better than. Number three. I wish I. More time to prepare for the presentation. A. Had had. B. Will have. C. Had. D. Have. The correct answer is C. Had. Number four. The results will fit. Tomorrow. A. B. Announced. B. Announce. C. Announced. D. Announcing. The correct answer is A. B. Announced. Number five. If he the meeting, he would have learned the new policy. A. Had attended. B. Attends. C. Would attend. D. Attended. The correct answer is A. Had attended. Number six. Despite busy, she completed the report. A. Been. B. Being. C. To be. D. Was. The correct answer is B. Being. Number 7. The CEO's leadership. The company expanded rapidly. A. Due to. B. Despite. C. Under. D. Because of. The correct answer is C. Under. Number 8. We expect the delivery. Next week. A. Arriving. B. Arrives. C. To arrive. D. Will arrive. The correct answer is C. To arrive.
Number 9. The new policies introduced next month. A. Will be. B. R. C. Is being. D. Was. The correct answer is A. Will be. Number 10. There is no rain tomorrow. We will hold the event. A. Because. B. If. C. Unless. D. Although. The correct answer is C. Unless. Number 11. He regretted the opportunity to work abroad. A. Miss. B. Missing. C. To miss. D. Missed. The correct answer is B. Missing. Number 12. We will finish the work. Friday. A. On. B. By. C. At. D. Until. The correct answer is B. By. Next up is Part 6. Reading. Text completion. Complete each text by choosing the best answer for the single gap. Number 1. Please ensure that the information provided is both accurate and a. Completeness. B. Complete. C. Completely. D. Completed. The correct answer is B. Complete. Number 2. The training session will At 9 a.m. sharp, please be on time. A. Commence. B. Commences. C. Commend. D. Commencement. The correct answer is A. Commence. Number 3. Hello, team. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the client meeting tomorrow will be. We will update you with the rescheduled timing. Best regards, account manager. A. Reschedules. B. Reschedule. C. Rescheduled. D. Rescheduling. The correct answer is C. Rescheduled. Number 4. Due to unforeseen circumstances, the seminar scheduled for next Wednesday has been to a later date. A. Postpone. B. Postponing. C. Postpones. D. Postponed. The correct answer is D. Postponed. Number 5. Please find Attach the Report for your review. Let us know if you have any questions. A. Month. B. Monthly. C. Months. D. Monthlies. The correct answer is B. Monthly. Number 6. Dear customer, your order has been successfully you will receive a shipping confirmation email soon. Thank you for shopping with us. Best customer service. A. Processed. B. Process. C. Processes. D. Processing. The correct answer is A. Processed. And finally, part 7. Reading. Reading comprehension. Get ready to read passages and answer questions based on them. Let's finish strong. Number 1. Dear team, the staff meeting scheduled for Friday has been moved to the following Monday at 9 a.m. in the conference room. Please prepare your reports and presentations accordingly. Best, John Doe. When is the rescheduled staff meeting? A. Friday at 9 a.m. B. Monday at 9 a.m. C. Monday at 10 a.m. The correct answer is B. Monday at 9 a.m. Number 2. Dear Team, We have scheduled a series of training workshops next month to enhance our skills in digital marketing. These sessions will be held every Tuesday and Thursday from 3 p.m. to 5 p.m. 
Participation is mandatory. What is the purpose of the scheduled workshops? A. To train on customer service. B. To introduce new software. C. To enhance skills in digital marketing. The correct answer is C. To improve team building. Number 3. Due to scheduled software upgrades, the company network will be offline on Saturday, February 10th, from 10 p.m. to 2 a.m. Please ensure that all necessary work is saved and completed before the downtime. We apologize for any inconvenience this may cause. When will the network be offline? A. February 11th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. B. February 10th, 8 a.m. to 12 p.m. C. February 10th, 10 p.m., 2 a.m. The correct answer is C. February 10th, 10 p.m., 2 a.m. Number 4. Dear Team, Our annual corporate retreat is scheduled for the next month. We will be heading to the mountains for a week of team-building activities, workshops, and relaxation. Please ensure you have completed the registration form and submitted any dietary restrictions by the end of this week. Looking forward to a productive retreat. Regards, HR Department. What is the main purpose of this email? A. To discuss financial results. B. To announce a new project. C. To inform employees about the corporate retreat. The correct answer is C. To inform employees about the corporate retreat. Number 5. To all customers, we are thrilled to introduce our new seasonal menu featuring fresh and locally sourced ingredients. Visit us today to try our special dishes and enjoy a unique dining experience. Cheers, the culinary team. What is the new feature mentioned in the announcement? A. A new seasonal menu. B. Extended business hours. C. A new loyalty program. The correct answer is A. A new seasonal menu. Number 6. Dear members, we are excited to inform you that the gym will be extending its hours starting next month. The new hours will be from 5 a.m. to 11 p.m., Monday through Sunday. We hope this extension allows for more flexibility in your workout schedule. Best, gym management. What change is being announced? A. New membership fees. B. New workout classes. C. Extended gym hours. The correct answer is C. Extended gym hours. Number 7. Dear employees, Due to upcoming maintenance works, the office cafeteria will be closed from September 20th to September 25th. During this period, please make alternative arrangements for your meals. We apologize for any inconvenience caused. Sincerely, Admin Team. Why is the cafeteria mentioned in the email? A. To inform about a change in opening hours. B. To notify of the temporary closure. C. To announce new menu items. The correct answer is B. To notify of the temporary closure. Number 8. Attention employees. Our annual team building retreat is scheduled for the weekend of October 5th through 7. This event will include a series of workshops, outdoor activities, and networking opportunities. Participation is mandatory for all full-time staff members. Please confirm your attendance by September 20th. Regards. HR Department. What is the main idea of this text? A. To introduce a new staff policy. B. To announce a team building retreat. C. To promote an outdoor adventure. The correct answer is B. To announce a team building retreat. Number 9. Dear colleagues, we are excited to announce that our company will be adopting a flexible working hours policy effective from next month. This initiative aims to improve work-life balance and increase productivity. 
Detailed guidelines will be shared via email shortly. Best wishes, the management. What is the announcement about? A. Salary increase. B. Introduction of flexible working hours. C. Office relocation. The correct answer is B. Introduction of flexible working hours. Number 10. We are writing to let you know about an upcoming upgrade to our online banking system, which will take place on the weekend of October 23rd. The website will be temporarily unavailable during this time. We appreciate your patience and will notify you as soon as the upgrade is complete. What will happen on the weekend of October 23rd? A. Launch of a new service. B. Online banking system upgrade. C. Website redesign. The correct answer is B. Branch opening. Number 11. Attention all employees. The company will be hosting a charity run on Saturday, November 5th. Participants can sign up via the link sent to your email. Let's come together for a great cause and support our local community. Regards, Event Committee. What is the event announced in the notice? A. A company picnic. B. A charity run. C. A team building workshop. The correct answer is B. A charity run. Number 12. Attention. All employees, please be informed that the monthly meeting has been rescheduled to next Tuesday, March 8th, at 10.00 a.m. in Conference Room B. Attendance is mandatory for all team members. Make sure to review the agenda before the meeting. Regards, HR Department. When will the rescheduled meeting take place? A. Today. B. Next Monday. C. Next Tuesday. The correct answer is C. Next Tuesday. Number 13. Dear members, to enhance your experience, our gym will introduce new fitness classes starting next month. Check the schedule on our website for more details. We hope you enjoy these new additions. Best regards, the Fitness Club. What is being introduced at the gym? A. New equipment. B. Extended hours. C. New fitness classes. The correct answer is C. New fitness classes. Number 14. Notice. The management has scheduled a fire drill for Wednesday, November 20th at 3 p.m. All employees are required to participate and follow the instructions provided by the safety officers. The drill is expected to last approximately 30 minutes. What event is being announced in the notice? A. A safety meeting. B. A fire incident. C. A fire drill. The correct answer is C. A fire drill. Number 15. Friends of the Library. We're happy to inform you that our annual book fair is scheduled for October 15th from 10 a.m. to 6 p.m. There will be a wide variety of books available, and all proceeds will benefit the library's programs. We hope to see you there. Sincerely, the library staff. When is the book fair taking place? A. September 20th. B. October 15th. C. November 10th. The correct answer is B. August 30th. Number 16. Colleagues, our annual performance reviews will commence on February 1st. Please ensure that you have your self-assessments completed by January 25th. Detailed instructions will be sent out soon. Regards, HR Department. What should employees complete by January 25th? A. Their self-assessments. B. Their project updates. C. Their holiday plans. The correct answer is A. Their self assessments. Number 17. Our new product line, EcoClean, is now available. EcoClean offers a range of eco friendly cleaning products. Visit our website to learn more and place your order today.
Enjoy a cleaner home and a cleaner planet with EcoClean. What is the purpose of the text? A. To promote EcoClean products. B. To provide cleaning tips. C. To announce a sale. The correct answer is A. To promote eco clean products. Number 18. Reminder All employees must complete the annual cybersecurity training by the end of this month. This training is essential to protect our company's sensitive information and meet regulatory requirements. Please log in to the training portal to complete the course. What is being requested from employees? A. To enroll in a new course. B. To change their passwords. C. To complete cybersecurity training. The correct answer is C. To complete cybersecurity training.